Hello, good afternoon, how are you? Well, <clears throat> what's going on with the Eclipse and the Divine Masculine um, this week? This is the time of the Eclipse in, in um, the Moon Eclipse for the Divine Masculine reading. How will it go for him this week? <clears throat> What's in his mind? What's in the mind of the Divine Masculine? Love. Love is in his mind. His uh, cup is full of love and love for his Divine Feminine. And he starts to see that, um, that there is love between them. But it's also he's also feeling very... Uh, awkward about it that's what I hear he's feeling awkward about it because he's not knowing if the door is still open for him oh but uh, he knows that there is love in his heart he's he know that love is on his mind how can he support this love how can he give this love and um, it's, it's on his mind 24-7, uh, I hear, you know, thinking about his divine feminine. Okay, how does he see the feminine? How does he see the divine feminine? How does he see the divine feminine? A card, please. Wow. He sees her as abundant. He sees her as um, that she is in the material realm. She is very established. That money is coming towards her. That she can manifest everything in her life. That she is doing all the things that she is uh, thinking of. She only has to think about something and it is manifested. He sees that um, there is money coming towards her. And um, yeah, that's, that's how he sees the Divine Feminine as very abundant. Uh, creating abundance for herself, but also um, <clears throat> sharing it, I hear. Okay, what is his higher self saying? What is the higher self of the Divine Masculine saying? What is the higher self? He has a burden. Release the burden. The higher self says, release the burden. There is no burden of feeling guilty, shame, um, and, and it, it drags you down. There is no... Um, don't punish yourself. Don't punish yourself. That's what I hear. And release that burden of guilt. And release that burden of deception. Um, it's also what I hear. He wants to come in to his divine feminine. But he also knows I can't come in with this burden. I need to release this. And if I release this, you know, um, I, will, I will be okay. And I need more love, uh, probably from the Divine Feminine, to release that burden. Because um, he is too hard on himself. That's what I hear. But he needs to be more patient. He needs to be, um, you know... I, I, I feel it's a double, double burden. Um, I, I hear it's a double burden because um, he's afraid that uh, he will do the same to his divine feminine as he did before. So he's not willing to take it. Yeah, he's not. It's not that he doesn't want to take a chance with with this love. It's more that the burdens are in the way. You know that he could be a burden for her um, in this in the, in this space. But I hear 
the divine feminine is so centered and she is not really hooked on herself um, that she that she stays in her center and when she stays in her center you know uh, she can do everything it's not that you are burden her by or a 3d matrix energy because she is taking you to a higher level uh, in every kind of way I hear and if you are um, releasing this burden it's easier for her to connect with you and uh, move you to a, a higher frequency and abundance uh, that she can share and that she will uh, um that she will open up with you you know uh what is in his heart space what is in his heart space what is in the divine masculine's heart space what's in the divine masculine's heart space he is re he he needs rest and he is stuck in his heart is stuck his heart is not moving his heart is you know wants rest wants peace because of all these burdens he needs to release all these burdens from his heart space and he can do it by uh, getting more rest uh, getting uh, not being stuck not being stubborn i hear as he is so stubborn, how oh, I'm home, this is fun. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, he is so stubborn that he make a competition out of everything. Uh, he he wants to challenge uh, the Divine Feminine. He wants to test her. And uh, the Divine Feminine is saying, okay, come on. You test me. I'm be tested by the universe for the last 12 years so what were you going to test me in i'm capable of doing this so i'm not afraid of any test anymore you come up and i will re I, I will show you i can do this you know it's um and even and that's that's the shadow side of the divine masculine that's coming up during the eclipse because it's the shadow that wants to test. It's the mind that wants to test the Divine Feminine. And the Divine Feminine, he knows that the Divine Feminine isn't afraid of anything. That she has enough courage to go through things. And she wants to help him to release this burden. And to unstuck himself. But that's something, she also says, you know, it's something that you need to do by yourself i can't i can't really help you in this um what does he want from her Ooh. i think they mirror each other he wants from her to get out of her cage to release uh, and, and, and start talking. Uh, he wants her to open up and not, not closing herself off for what's going on uh, in her heart space. Because she's putting herself uh, in, an, in an energy and that's what he wants from her, to open up, to start the communication to um, not withdraw herself because um, he can't do anything about this. He, he doesn't know where she is at, at this space. And that, that will happen, you know, after the moon eclipse, this energy will change. And um, that gives him also a burden. Like, you know, I see how much I hurt you. And I, I also know um, I don't want to repeat this. I don't want to repeat this. And um, I, 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 
I hear, <laughs> I, 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 it's almost like I, 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 I want this, I want this, I want this. But release yourself, you know? How does he seize the relationship with the Divine Feminine? How does he seize the relationship? Wow. That she is her empress. He knows his, uh, that she is the Divine Feminine and that there, that there is a new cycle coming up. That there, this cycle is, is, is moving forward to a new beginning after the eclipse. And um, the Divine Feminine will open herself more. This is what he wants with her. You know, and her relationship. He wants her to be herself and open up the circle, start a new circle, um, be in her in her uh, space and, and clearing everything out so he can embrace her as the Divine Feminine. What blocks him? Um, what blocks him are the secrets he had for her or still has for her, it could be, um, that he needs to come in balance and that he needs to, um, that he can address his Divine Feminine. He needs to talk to his Divine Feminine about everything you know, that slowed him down. Why it's so slow? Why he can't move? You know, talk about his burdens um, and come back in balance. But he doesn't want to um, burden her with his stuff because he created it himself. Self-inflicted energy, I hear. And she is there, you know, to help him go through. But there's still a secret that needs to come out in the open. He need, still needs to talk to her. Um, and that is blocking him. That is really blocking him. How will he solve this? How will he solve this? How will he solve this? Oh my gosh, celebrating with her, having a party, um, be pleasant, be joyful, uh, create more time and space with her to celebrate. And um, there is a lot going on that he wants to do. He will solve this by, you know, having fun with her, you know? He wants to have fun. And if it's not possible to have fun with her, um, there will be something else to have fun with, I hear. So he is still not growing and still doing the things he wants to do and getting from the outside. What will bring it? What will bring it? What will bring it? What will it bring to him? What will it bring to him if he celebrates with her? What will it bring when he celebrates with her? What will it bring when he celebrates with the Divine Feminine? It will bring him love. He will be the Emperor. He, all his cups will be filled. All, he needs to celebrate with her. He needs to be... Uh, uh, joyful cheerful you know leave leave this burden behind you know and 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 he thinking about this love so he needs to step into this love and uh, where he's thinking about and take some action and release the burdens you know release the burdens and then you know that will bring him 
um, all the joy, all the happiness, all the love. And where is his focus at the moment? Where is his focus at the moment? Where is his Oh, I hear you're always good enough for your Divine Feminine. You're always being good enough because the universe don't judge. You know, it's just a mental space that judge. Wow, his focus is on love. His focus is on his Divine Feminine and wants this love with her. He wants to carry her. He wants to support her. He wants to hold her. He wants to kiss her. He wants to hold her in his arms. But he's not... He's... I'm... Okay, there's a channeling coming. I'm not... No, I don't know if you're able and open enough to receive me and to, to let me hold you, to let me kiss you, to... Because... You put yourself on this, this corner and you put yourself in these, these, um, you closed yourself off. And it could be that you're scared, scared of the love that we have, you know, because I hurt you so much. But I, please, we forgave each other. Let's, let's move in. Let's merge this sacred union let's do this let's do this together i know i have to have more time i know i have to have more time but i still love you and you know i love you so we i want this merging with you i want this be released i want this to be released because you are protecting yourself and I'm totally, totally understand this that you're protecting yourself of what 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 everything what happened. But we both we, we both know that this love is too deep and that I will never ever can let you go and I will want to give it a try. I want to get this union. And we are already in union. You know that we are already in union. You know this. So why protect yourself? Please open, communicate with me. Open up with me. And I will, I, I will give you the world. I won't talk anymore. I will take the action. And you, in my actions, you see how much I love you. Wow. I feel this in my heart space. Where does he want the relationship to go? Union. He just told, he just told the Divine Feminine that he wants union with her. He wants union with her. He wants to come together with her and celebrate life being there for her through all the all the things she's going through. He will be there for her. I hear I will go for the to the end of the world for you. Now I know that we are in union. Now I know that we are together, that I have a second chance with you. You know, and this is my heart's desire. This is what I wanted. All, my, all the time I wanted this. I couldn't commit with my heart to someone else. Because you were always here in my heart. Wow. Whew. How does he feel on the union? How does he feel on the union? What does he feel on the union? And a union doesn't mean marriage. A union means being together with emerge in 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 um,
what he feels on the union. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Love. He wants this union with her. He wants it desperately. You know, I have here, how is this possible? I can't make it up, guys. I can't make this up. You know, the lovers, the lovers and the union card. This is what he wants. He wants the union. He wants to be with her. He wants to be close with her. You know? He wants to celebrate life with her. I hear, I'm sorry, but I can't. I, I hear, sorry, but I can't um, think about what I did to you. I'm so grateful that you, um, I'm so grateful that you forgave me, that you want to give me a second chance, that you are, that I'm in your heart space and you are in my heart space and you were always the one for me from day one i start i don't know who i was wh when this happened it wasn't me i wasn't the person i'm now and i'm i'm here for you to step up and i'm here for you to clear everything out and make it up to you as i should have done my whole life okay I'm, I'm back. We're, I'm glad we're getting back as the universe is guiding us back to each other time and time again. And we need to solve it. We need to solve the things, you know. We are two different persons. You do things with emotion and the heart. And I do the things with my mind and my logic and we we need to make a bridge and that's the only th only time we can survive okay and they they can survive this because uh, with the twin flame reading they also had the ma they made the bridge by their hands promising each other okay What's combining them? What is combining them? Wow. What is combining them? What is combining them? Oh my goodness. That they belong together and they both don't see it. They, they, you know, they're both stuck in communication and they see each other and they see the love, but they don't want to talk about it. And that combines them both. You know, they're, they're both blind for this, for this union. The divine feminine sees his, sees, sees him as her emperor and the divine masculine sees it as this fiery woman with full of passion but you know they both don't see it they both aren't really um working together they just need to to wrap this up and 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 go for it you know they want to see, they want to have proof. Both they want to have proof of their love. Just take action, I hear. Communicate, communicate and take action. That's what the higher self says. What brings them together? What brings them together? What brings the divine masculine and the divine feminine together? What wants the Divine Masculine to bring them together? Hmm. 
release the burden. You know, what brings them together? Probably a, a very defeating time. It could be uh, that there is a hard time coming up and that will bring them together. You know, there is something uh, going to happen that will bring them to their knees uh, or yeah, that, that, you know, there is enough support, but they, one or the two needs to, to, to kneel, to bow, you know, to say, okay, um, we are going for this. And I think it's the divine masculine that after releasing his burdens, he will come to her and say, okay, I'm ready for this. But I also see the divine feminine say, you know, don't, don't, don't go down by this. You made a choice and there are many choices to be made. And again, you don't need to feel ashamed about a choice you make because you knew all along. And it's also about, okay, it's about releasing the shame and releasing the regret and the remorse that you have over a situation. Also know that the other person will go to their life purpose not only you, and it could be a third party, that there was a third party karmic in the way. You needed to go through this cycle to understand what, what you really wanted in your life, what, is, what your life is planned for. And it could be, you know, your divine feminine, but you will have enough freedom. You want to have freedom, but you want to be with your divine feminine. And wow, thank you, thank you, thank you, spirit. Open yourself for it and it will arrive, you know. Open yourself up for it and it will arrive. When you have freedom, you have time for yourself, then everything will work out. But you need to release that burden. You can't go come down to your divine feminine. Oh my gosh, okay. Spirit says, open your heart, stand up. Look her in the eyes and say, I'm back. When you really, really feel it. When you feel it, you need to be there for her. Times are coming up. She is there for you. But she, oh wow, Divine Feminine doesn't, does not know if you're open to receive the love she wants to give to you at this time when you are releasing, when you having burdens, when you are down. Because she don't want to interfere with your healing process. But if she is a part of your healing process, you need to address it to her. If you address to her, I need you, I want you to hold me because I'm going through a rough period of time. You know, she will be there for you. Wow, wow, wow. Guys, I'm, I'm getting so hot here from all these energies coming through. Uh, I hope you had something for, for, um, for this reading. This will happen after, um, I think, um, this week, upcoming week, after the eclipse. And I want to give um, a Whispering of Nature card for the Divine Masculine. Wow, I'm on fire, guys. Thank you for all these channelings. Thank you, thank you. I'm so grateful that I can do this work. 
that you give me the energy and the time and the space creating the space and the time for me to do this wow hope and happiness hope and happiness Keep on the faith, go to your feminine, there is hope and there is happiness in your whole life throughout, throughout this time. Hope. Explore. Go to the mountains. Fly away with her. Connecting with the goddess, connecting with her. Connecting with nature, connecting with the water, connecting with her. And keep your dreams alive. Keep your dreams alive. Your dreams, your future, keep them alive. Because your dreams who are living in your heart space, that's living in your soul, that needs to be heard that needs to be answered. And maybe, you know, your Divine Feminine will join you or you have to do it by yourself. Give your time, self, space, explore, go and explore. Keep your dreams alive. Dreams, oh, how I get a song through. Dream about dreams. If I, if I find a song, I will put it in the description bo box below. Because I, the, the, no, the, 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 the lyrics of the song are called Dreams. So I will, um, I don't know the artist, but I will find out. I will thank you for this reading for this week. If you want a private reading with me, I can channel your Divine Masculine, his energy, uh, where you're at. If you want me to help you... Um, if there are blocks in your union, let me know. Uh, I can deblock it. That's an, a 90 minute uh, reading. So I have a reading for 33 minutes. It's uh, or uh, 30 minutes. It's 33 pounds. 60 minutes. It's 60 pounds. 66 pounds. And 90 minutes is 99 pounds. And you get a clearance in that. A healing, a clearance, um, clearing out the blocks that are between you and your Divine Masculine. Are, uh, karmic blocks, it could be that there are um, um, uh, energy ties, uh, we releasing everything. So uh, let me know so everything can go and, and flow again. So thank you so much and uh, Namaste all your blessings i love you all and i hope to see you next week bye bye